Mortal. <laughs> Mortal. You mortal. <laughs> Am I what? <laughs> I'm not drunk. How dare you disrespect me? I strained your godforsaken soul out of your body. <laughs> You're a funny mortal. You really are. <laughs> Woo! Hey! Servant, give me another round of this delicious drink. You're one of my favorite mortals. <laughs> oh, mm. <clears throat> that hit the spot. For something to not be blood, this really is exquisite. What is this called? Hmm. A wine cooler? Well, wine coolers. <coughs> uh. oh, it tastes much better than wine, but wine is still fine as ever. Wine is Best thing in the world. <laughs> yeah, I told you the story where this prostitute, male prostitute, came up to me asking me for a good time. Alright, you never heard of it. I'll tell you this. So, around the medieval ages, you know, of course. 1800s, 1700s, 1600s, whatever. Whatever the fuck you could call it. Um, I was simply just having a midnight stroll. I couldn't sleep, of course. You know, rich noble woman. <coughs> Walking down the street. It's me. I'm the rich noble woman. The rich noble woman and me. My beauty and my grace. The elegant smell of blossoms coming from me. I brought attention of men, of course. I am dire beautiful. Incredibly beautiful. This bottle cap. You see, this bottle cap, right? I heard so many of you about things about bottle caps. I might, I might collect these. Oh, it's wasn't material. Wait, a crack. I was simply strolling down the pathway of the my of the city, going to get something to eat, or just going for a walk. But I end up getting something to eat. Uh, this was before I turned into a full-bred vampire, as you can see right in front of you right now. So, just minding my business, just walking, just walking, just walking. And a man jumps out from the shadows. And he just climbs on top of that. And he jumps out of the shadows like a panther or tiger in the heat. It's like an agile tiger in the heat. And he just came to me and grabbed me by my waist and looked me in my eyes and told me. You're such a beautiful maiden, and I just want you all to myself. You look delectable. I could just eat you up right now. And I said.
said to you, oh, you would eat me. You would eat me. I would eat you, though. <laughs> I told him, I'll eat him. Uh, he looked at me. He looked at me with the most seductive look ever on his face. He did like an idiot at the same time. He wanted me so badly. I wanted to go at him. I wanted him. I wanted him as well, too. Both our erotic aroma filled like a barrier around us. We was gonna do it until one of my bodyguards found me and cock blocked him and me. I got cocked, basically. I got cocked. And he was like, my lady, what are you doing out here by yourself? Blah, blah, blah. He shouldn't be here. No, 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 no. You shouldn't be here. So he told him to back off and fuck off and you're not having this noble lady. I found out that, yeah, he was so upset about it. So on top of that, um, he, me and him did not do the sex. <laughs> we could have done it. Uh, we could have done it really good. <sighs> but anyways, we could have done it. I got dragged away by my bodyguard. My father was upset. But guess what happened the next night? I slept with my bodyguard. Me and him had a few drinks. We got to know him and... He was better than the male prostitute. How did I know? Oh, that's a nice contraption. Let's more. I don't know what this is. interesting juice. I think what I'm going to juice is one cooler thing. Oof. Kind of a got a tipsy smell. <laughs> Let me open this. Oh. Mm. Slow down. No. How many did I have? Probably 50. <laughs> I'm dead. My liver is not active. <laughs> Literally, my liver is not active. I'm dead. So, I could, if I'm dead, I could still get drunk. I could still get drunk. So, fuck off. <laughs> mm. I did it with a lot of men, you know, I'm so, I'm so, <laughs> what am I doing, what am I doing, <laughs> what is it, what am I doing with my life, I'm a vampire for God's sakes. I'm the queen of darkness, queen of vampires, and I'm literally over here talking about how many men I slept with. I'm literally drinking this thing called wine coolers, and I don't know what I'm doing with my life. I live so long doing God knows what. <laughs> Why not? I had to go 
go to a masquerade party because my father wanted to make truce with the king and everything. And he wanted to be friends with the king. And then I met this man and then he came out of nowhere, took me out for the stroll in the courtyard and then just, just danced. I fell in love with this man. I danced with him and then he bit me and then I died in his arms and I became a vampire and I can't do jack shit right now. And then on top of that, the man that I was with that turned me into a vampire, I was dating him. And then he cheated on me with another woman and then I had to kill him. I need to stop drinking this truth juice. I need to go take a nap. I need to go to sleep. I'll see you the next night. Good night, Mortal. Good night.